So Harry and Ho moving around, trying to entice her opponent to commit to her kick. Frank Chan Taipei not falling for it. Much different tempo from the previous finals that we've seen. Trying to look for an opening against the taller Chinese Taipei athlete. Referee wants more activity. Nice back kick attempt by the Korean. Cautious start by both players. Hold more proactive. Which she has to be to overcome that slight height disadvantage. <laughs> nice cut underneath, no point. <laughs> Closing seconds of the first round. Just a one point there, that lift exchange by Harry Ho, scored that one point. That was a back kick attempt. Not quite enough power there by the Ty Taipei athlete to score. So Ho one point ahead. Definitely a change in tempo from the previous final. But again, at the end of the first round, that was the same score. So let's see if we have an explosion of activity in the second round. Referee wants more activity now in this uh, this final, the minus 67 kilogram division. Oh, definitely playing the counter match, but she's not getting. Oh, there's a nice attempt that I, Chinese Taipei for a double off the front leg. Oh, definitely looking for the counter, not active enough. She's getting caught underneath, but Taipei's not hitting strongly enough. She's connecting with the trunk protector but there's not sufficient power there to score. Trying is very frustrating. I've seen her many, many times in Grand Prix and in World Championships, and she never seems to explode into action like she seems capable of doing when you see her training. Oh, more tactical, picking her opponent off. Tries a punch, not very convincing. We get a gun goal here for going out. But there's an exchange that I didn't even see that headshot. So Taipei took a headshot, um, actually scored a headshot.
He, that was amazing. That was amazing. Ho cut round for the back kick. Chuang counter kicked the back kick with perfect position and timing. I didn't see it in the in the exchange, but when we saw that in slow motion, you could see it clear as day. It was a very good movement. She's suffering now, though. Just got caught with a low kick. The doctor or the first aid seems to be applying some sort of uh, treatment. Oh, there we go. Yeah, that's not nice. She's up on her feet. She's got one minute to recover, and she's used approximately 30 seconds of that. So she'll carry on. The, she'll be happy. She got the three points headshot. She just just go back onto the, into the game. And hopefully she's only got 13 seconds to carry on and then she'll get a minute in the break between rounds. So she should be fully recovered by the start of the third round. Ho oh, tried a back kick there. Again it went low but she didn't seem deterred so it's good that she's still trying the back kicks. So Taipei leads by three points to one with this. And if it shows again, that's some of the kicks that weren't scoring. Gesturing there to try and influence the judges, but that doesn't work anymore. Let's see if we see the back kick and the counter kick to the head that cut through underneath. I don't get a chance to see that one in that break, but. Shrangs up in the feet. She still looks in discomfort. I think she got caught again with another low kick, but she's still in discomfort. She's clearly in discomfort. She's almost doubled over there. That might slow her down. Here we hope we'll uh, try and take advantage of that. I think if she could actually connect with one of those back kicks, she'll take the lead. So I think that might be in the back of her mind. The legs, the kick in the front leg raising is not really convincing attempts at scoring, so I think she'll be looking for the back kick. Definitely, Schwang's definitely struggling. She looks in discomfort. And trying to hold on to this lead, she's not the most proactive athlete at the best of times, but she's definitely in pain. And now Ho's trying to take advantage of this, attacking more, cutting to the body. She isn't scoring though, she needs to be more accurate and more powerful. Still think the back kick is the best option for him. Goes for the head and scores it. And we've got two points of registered there, two headshots have registered. So the coach hasn't appealed, the, so there must have been two shots there. Now she's got to take another one. So what we saw there was a complete turnaround with two headshots scored. And now the Olympic champion is leading in a very convincing fashion. Harry Ho is leading by eight points to three with two, with two headshots. There might have been two impacts in that. And it's Schwang's got to, she's in discomfort, but she's definitely got to chase now. One in there takes it to eight points to four. There's only 13 seconds left. Schwang doesn't look like she's got it in her to get this back. Despite that clever headshot that she did in the exchange, I think she's still struggling from the low, low kick in that same exchange. And that is it. The Olympic champion is also Grand Prix champion. An amazing turnaround. Three points to one down. She gets a headshot. It registers twice. I'd like to see the review on that, the replay on that as well. But the Olympic champion is now also Grand Prix 2016 final champion. I wonder if we will get to see that.